Hi, my name's Ben McCauley and I'm a paramedic with Air Ambulance Kent Surrey and Sussex and I'm going to read you The Family Oops and Burns First Aid by Christina Siles. In a rickety house down the Smoky Hill Close lived the family Oops who everyone knows. Brother and sister and both parents Oops were quite careless with hot things when there was no excuse. Mummy Oops wore bright lipstick and liked to look good. She straightened her hair way more than you should. Without wearing sunscreen, she sunbathed for hours. Then red as a beetroot, she spent days in cold showers. Mummy Oops left her straighteners on the back of a door handle and little girl Oops tried to follow Mummy's example. She touched the red hot tongs and felt a horrible ouch. If only Mummy Oops used a heat resistant straightener pouch. Daddy Oops loved his tea and an outdoor barbecue. He would boil a kettle and leave it to brew. Baby Oops reached to taste Daddy's favourite drink, pulling down the hot liquid in what seemed like a blink. Days of rain made the barbecue harder to light, so Daddy Oops poured some special liquid to help it ignite. When his t-shirt caught fire, the firefighters came and said, stop, cover your face, drop and roll, put out the flames. So the Oops went to school run by Mrs. Coolwater, who taught first aid for burns and the importance of water. The Oops family listened to Mrs. Coolwater's burn lessons on what you should do during the first valuable seconds. Going out in the sun without sunscreen or hat and touching hot surfaces can hurt rather bad. Hot water and fire can lead to a burn. Prevention is key, as the Oops family learn. Putting toothpaste on burns won't do the trick. Using egg whites or ice cream can make you quite sick. Cream is too thick and butter too greasy. Eggs are just eggy and ice is quite freezing. First aid for burns follows four simple steps. Remove, cool and cover, then call for some help. Remove nappies or jewellery and any loose clothing as they hold in the heat and stop swelling evolving. 20 minutes of cooling under running tap water is the most vital burn treatment taught Mrs. Cool Water. Don't apply frozen peas or any ice or cold fluids and it may save you a trip to the local burns unit. Use a loose piece of cling film to cover your burn. It will lessen the stingy sore feeling in turn. Take some usual medicine to make the pain go away and call for some help with no further delay. The Oops family passed all the tests at the school and received first aid champion badges, which did look quite cool. They proudly showed off their awards to their friends and shared their first aid message the Burns team recommends. First aid for burns follows four simple steps. Remove, cool and cover and call for some help. Will Mrs. Coolwater find a new superstar? I think it will be you and you will go far.